I sure did, Preston, and this is just such a troubling trend that we keep reporting on here in Seattle. The wife, she was picking their kids up from school, and that's when the teens stole her vehicle. Two 15-year-olds, two 12-year-olds, and one 13-year-old detectives believe are linked to a series of violent crimes. Just a very frustrating expense to take on. I spoke with one of the innocent victims whose car was stolen. The windows smashed, all for the thrill of juvenile crime. According to some witnesses who saw it, um, the people had taken it, driven it around the block a few times, um, and left it where it was. Mm -hmm. So, just in the middle of the street. The family's blue Hyundai is just one of the many cars involved in the wild pursuit that ended here along 15th and 80th. Police say the T-bone crash involved the suspect's car and another person who was just driving along. She said that the car was found in the middle of the street, the, the wipers were going, the lights were on or whatever, it was just kind of left. They had smashed the uh, passenger side window. Seattle detectives believe the five minors are connected to a series of crimes starting in late April, including robbery, assault, auto theft, vehicular assault, and hit and run. This is the second time this has happened to us this year. We're just more tired and frustrated that this just keeps kind of happening. Three of the teens were arrested at the site of the crash. Another one of the boys, he was arrested after a short foot pursuit in the 15. He was found hiding in a yard nearby. Thankfully, no one was injured during all of this chaos. Live in Seattle, Hannah Knowles, Como News.